Be me. Leaving the gym. Hold the door open for blonde cutie behind me. She says, hey, you're cute. Thought you should know that. Smile at her, tell her thanks, and walk to my car. That happened a few days ago. I feel because I've been single for a few months, and I easily could have asked for her number. Should I try to get her number? I haven't seen her at the gym in a couple days and I'm worried that she's probably someone else by now. Talk to cute girl at work. Everything goes well. We have the same interests and laugh a lot together. Topic switches to relationships. Oh, JPG. When was your last relationship and on? Shook.jpg. Don't know what to say. Decide to tell the truth. Yeah, I never really had one. She starts laughing. Doesn't believe me. I tell her that I am not joking. She continues laughing and tells me I am funny. No seriously who was your last ex-girlfriend? Look her in the eyes. I never had one. She looks at me with a confused look. Okay. We chat a little bit more and then go back to work. Haven't really spoken since that day except for greeting each other. She seems to avoid me now. My face when my inexperience at age 24 has cucked me. Be me. Sixth grade chubby kid. First crush on girl. Everyone tells me she likes me too. Full of confidence. Go up to her. Ask her out. She says no. Suddenly, kids started to laugh all around me. Everyone was insulting me, and calling me a loser. Got bullied for being rejected for the rest of the school year. Later find out that it was all a prank, and that my crush was part of it. Lose confidence. Never ask girl out again out of fear of humiliating myself again. 21 years old now. Still a virgin, and never had a girlfriend. Terrified so much of falling in love that, Every time I develop feelings for a girl, I just ignore them. Started doing heavy drugs to cope with stupid love feelings. Degenerated into an addict to various opiates. Mom is still asking when I'm gonna get a girlfriend. Get in car. Try to disengage handbrake. Handbrake won't disengage. Keep trying but it won't go down. Suddenly think about how it reminds me of an erect Huh. I have an idea. Start to off the handbrake. Pretend to tease its tip a little and gently press in the button. Dirty talk to it about how I'm the dominant one and it's a little that anybody can easily overpower. It off faster and reach climax. Try to disengage handbrake again. Instantly goes down. What the It worked. Is my car a B? Be me. Girlfriend loves a dad bod. Don't have dad bod though. Obese reddit mod bod. What do I do? Be me. Be in school. Looked up to someone who, in retrospect, was probably a bad influence. Bullied a kid for being annoying. Got to the point where he went from jolly, to absolutely miserable. Actually felt bad for him, and tried to make peace, but that never got anywhere. Had many autistic meltdowns. Make a YouTube account when I was way too young to have one. Looked up to someone, who in retrospect, was a bad influence. Bullied a Minecraft kid for making videos. Got to the point where the kid had to delete his channel. OK.png. Had many autistic meltdowns online. Get to high school. Had a Reddit ego, and superiority complex was going through a leafy and cringe compilation fan phase. Bullied a girl for being edgy. She had to move schools. Got into a fight with some older kid, where he bit me, and I tried to strangle him. He also had to move schools. Had many autistic meltdowns at high school. All this and I didn't realize exactly what I was doing. Be me, now. Be almost 20. Wondering why I am still here. Every day is filled with regret, I can't bring myself to get over it. This green text is just many of the bad things I did. I didn't even mention what I did to my niece, or that time I fought the school principal, all because I didn't want to write an apology letter to my music teacher, 
or the time I ran a joke on Discord to the ground, to the point where it was psychological torment for the owner. What if these people I mentioned had permanent mental scars, or had hurt themselves, or worse, because of the things I did? How do I let go of that? Was the person I was, the person I am today? Am I just a terrible person? Sometimes I wish I was someone else. You have reached the end. Don't forget to like and subscribe to see more green texts like these.